Hi guys, welcome back. So if you guys remember that few days before we did a Q&A session on Instagram and Facebook. First of all, I would like to thank all those who have participated in that question answer sessions. And secondly, I really like to apologize you guys for being so late in coming with this video. Anyway, moving on to today's video, uh, let's move on to the first question and begin the video because I don't want to ramble today. So the first question is what is your age? So my age is 22, my year of birth is 1996. Now the second question is who am I dating? This one is a very interesting question. If you are an active follower of me on Instagram and an active subscriber on YouTube, you know that I date food and I date makeup. Anyways, if you want me to be serious, let me tell you that I am single, I don't date anyone and I think I am courageous enough to declare this on the internet and yeah, that's all. So that's all about this question. The second question is, when is your birthday? So my birthday is on 29th of October. Now next we have a question from a boy and he asked that he is shaving regularly and he is getting so much pimples on his cheeks and please give me a remedy on how to get rid of these pimples either your skin is reacting to the razor or it is reacting to the shaving cream but whatever your skin is sensitive before starting the process whenever you shave first prep your skin very well with some aloe vera gel and then you start it before shaving care is also very important just uh, right after you shave your face don't forget to apply ice cubes on your face also apply some raw aloe vera gel in that way i'm sure you're going to get rid of your problem so the next question is where do i see myself five years from now i don't at all plan anything nowadays because in the past few years i have learned a lot of things that well whatever i plan everything happens the opposite way that in turn breaks your heart and you get disheartened and you feel sad and life becomes so miserable so then i learned how to surrender to god i don't plan anything i just know i'm just going to keep my 100 percent on the work i'm doing and rest i leave everything on the lord whatever whether good or bad everything is supposed to be decided by him and I know I'm damn sure that everything is going to be pretty well and smooth and that's all. So the next question is how to get rid of dark circles. So this one is a very serious issue these days. Everyone is facing the problem of dark circles including me. So first thing I would like to say that before treating the dark circles first try to analyze what are the things that is actually causing you dark circles now so number one is insufficient sleep we sleep very late the sleeping habit is not regular sometimes we sleep at 12 sometimes we sleep at 1 a.m some of them i know some of them they sleep by 2 a.m 3 a.m which is seriously very bad so before treating your dark circles first accept that you have dark circles that everybody have dark circles there is nothing to get paranoid again that you have dark circles if you have then accept it and try to treat it don't overthink about it then only you will see a very effective result matter whether you apply cucumber tomatoes potatoes this that but if you constantly think that you have dark circles nothing is going to give you the result you have to drink lots and lots of water you have to sleep early you have to include salads in your meal that is all i would like to say and apply all those homemade treatments those also works but you have to be regular with it that's all that's all about dark circles now next question is how to get rid of open pores open pores is also another serious issue you are getting open pores either because your skin is extremely oily it secretes too much of oil or it is because you're you're exposed to sun so wash your face every day with ice cubes drink lots and lots of water again eat salads salads and waters are the two major important things which will give you a healthy problem free and glowing skin so i would like to give you one effective remedy for open pores that is tomato scrub cut a tomato into half and apply some sugar on the tomato and scrub it every single day do not skip a day i'm damn sure your open pores are going to shrink and give you a glass looking skin so that's all about this question now the next question is how to get rid of dry patches on your skin you are getting dry patches on your skin because you have a dry skin and you do not moisturize your skin or you're having dry patches on your skin because your skin is directly exposed to sun without having a sunscreen now if you have a dry skin 
to moisturize it very properly with a good quality moisturizer that suits your skin and if you don't have dry skin but still you have dry patches that means you are exposed to direct sun in that case do not step out of the house without applying a sunscreen whether it is winter whether it is monsoon or whether it is summer do not step out of the house without a sunscreen on so that's all about this question now moving on to the next question this question is how do you maintain a skincare routine don't you get tired don't you get bored of maintaining a skincare routine so if you are a beginner and you have just started your skincare routine i'm damn sure you will get tired you will get bored and you need to set alarm for your skincare routine but uh, as the time goes you know you will be used to your skincare routine you will be so used to it that even if you miss it by chance you will feel like you miss something out of your life so it's just a matter of habit once you get habituated to it it will become a part and parcel of your life like the way you don't forget to brush your teeth take a shower this skincare routine will also become a part and parcel of your life that's all how i maintain it i enjoy maintaining my skincare routine and that's all now the next question is how to get rid of hair fall now hair fall is such a complicated topic to talk about because it depends on so many factors it depends on climate it depends on the products you use it depends on genetic factors as well it depends on weather it also depends on your food habit to a great extent so i would like to say that first analyze what is giving you hair fall whether it is some new product which you have just started using it or whether it is the weather because of change of weather we get hair fall even i suffer from hair fall issue but i try to sort it out i try to analyze it and i then try to treat it don't use chemical products a lot on your hair at all possible do try to skip chemicals and try to use ayurvedic hair care products and if you use a lot of hair styling tools make sure to use a hair protectant spray or hair protectant creams and take good care of your hair like maintain a good hair care routine when is the right time to apply hair oil when is the right time to wash your hair the small things which you need to take care about you have to drink sufficient water you need to add nuts on your diet and that's all have a proper sleep have a healthy life and that's all how you can deal with hair fall how to get rid of split ends just chop it off just chop it off every month i kid you not i'm just telling that take the ends of your hair like so and it's the time for me to chop my hair and going to chop it tomorrow anyway so take just inch size and just chop it off and you're going to get relief from those split ends and rough ends so that's all about this question so that was the last question and with this we come to the end of today's video i hope you guys enjoyed i really enjoyed filming this video i really enjoyed answering to all your lovely questions i am again very thankful to you guys for asking me such lovely questions i hope to come up with similar q and a sessions again in the future and i hope you guys will participate in the same way and if you want some more q and a sessions do let me know in the comment section below and do also let me know your thoughts about today's video i would really like to know that i am pretty serious this time i'm very sorry in the past few days i was so irregular with the videos that i can't even apologize i feel so sorry but i had some issues so i couldn't come up with the videos i was so irregular with it and i hope you guys will understand and you do so and that is the reason why i love you all so much so i will see you guys in my next video till then stay happy take care and keep connecting with my channel thank you so much for watching guys